What's up, everyone? Gigi G Man 101 right here, hanging out with you. And I do apologize um, ahead of time. I completely lost my voice. It actually sounds great right now compared to what it was um, yesterday and the day before that. Um, G Men, the G Men, our old defense, the old New York football Giants defense for the time being, is back. Incredible. So far, we're still early in the season, but the Giants have been the only team that's been able to shut down Johnson and Foster. No one else has been able to do that. No one. No one. And great game by our receivers. Hakeem Nix, Steve Smith especially. Brandon Jacobs had a few great runs that uh, reminded us of the days of Brandon Jacobs that we used to know and love. And 34-10 uh, to 10 final score, Giants beat the Texans. Incredible. Uh, great game. Uh, obviously, last week in Chicago, we were very pumped that we won, but it, it wasn't the best game. Houston, we took care of business against a very talented Texans team. And right now, uh, the Giants fans, we're, we're doing our homework. We're eating dinner. And a few hours from now, we're going to sleep. Happy people. I have class tomorrow, but tonight, when I go to sleep and I have dreams of this game, I'm going to sleep like a freaking baby. Um, just great, great game, great game. Um, next week we play Detroit, and a few Giants fans are going to be like, hey, we, we got this in the bag. We're awesome. Detroit's 0 4. Don't, as this week goes on, do not overlook the Detroit Lions. 0 4, but they are a good team, and they can get the job done in certain situations. Um, going around the NFC, uh, the Cowshits. Are losing right now. Hold on, let me go double check. It's 34 <coughs> 27 with a little under three minutes remaining. So the cow shits are on the verge of going one and three. We'll see what happens. I don't know if this score is going to hold up or if the cow shits going to come back and tie or take the lead. You guys will know what happens. The Redskins shock the Packers. Come back overtime. In D.C., the Redskins continue to roll, and the Eagles, uh, an hour from now, are the Sunday night game over in Cali against the San Francisco 49ers, which promises to be a great game. The Niners are in the same boat as the Detroit Lions, in my opinion. 0-4, but do not overlook them, and they're going against the Philadelphia Eagles team that has a quarterback that is worse than I am at playing football, and there's not a lot of people out there that are worse than me. No, I'm just kidding. I'm, I make a pretty good quarterback. But Kevin Cobb is awful. The 49ers need to take advantage of this. And although the Eagles have a great chance of winning, this is also a great chance for the Niners at home to get their first win of the 2010 season. Um, what else do I need to say in my little rant of football? It's a great game by the Giants. The, the defense is back. I haven't seen defense like that and again uh, against Chicago last week from this team in a very long time. And uh, there's a lot of confidence right now and confidence that our team through this season and next year are headed in the right direction based on what I've seen. Um, so that's that. Giants fans, let's enjoy it. By the way, uh, high fives and clapping for me, the other Yankee fans and the Yankees. We sweep the Minnesota Twins again. We are headed to the ALCS to play the winner of the Tampa Bay Rays and the Texas Rangers. The Rays have tied things up at two. Um, also, the Phillies uh, have a 2-0 lead over the Reds. They travel to Cincinnati in about an hour to play that game. And the Giants and Braves, um, I'm not exactly sure that one is 1-1, one one, but they're playing earlier. I don't know if that game's over. Um, so we'll see what happens. I'll make another baseball vid during the week as the playoffs continue. So you guys have a good one. Enjoy your Sunday night. Giants fans, enjoy this win because it feels fantastic. feels fantastic. Follow Twitter for fun, fun and frolic, fun and frolic, fun and frolic. I will catch you guys later. Have a great Sunday. Have a chill week. Do your work. And I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good one.